And what you are forcing me to do is negotiate with a terrorist. When I first started Fred Bassett, my friend, I swore that nothing would come between me and reading that cartoon. I've been waxed, I've been burnt, I've been tortured, you've made me vomit, you've strapped me to a roller coaster, you've pinched me, you've punched me, you've shot me, mm. you've had my mum disown me, yep. you've made my girlfriend destroy my things, yep. you've flushed away my medication, yep. but still, Bassett has been read. But the man that swore those words was probably was a man it was a younger man he hadn't tasted the gravy ship he no, hadn't he seen hadn't firsthand he, what it could do to people yeah, I'll hit you right and you it. have put me in a situation my friend where by destroying yeah. that pallet of chips will crush people and i don't know if i could live with the crumbs of those chips on my conscience it'd be it crumbs on your hands mate i've slapped you in the taste buds i've, I've punched you don't in, you in, dare in, hold in, the chips over me ever again andy but i never th tummy. i never thought i would have to use this but it saddens me to play the following tape. You gotta cry, cause it's wrong that we don't get to listen to Fred Bassett on the radio. You ruined chip time. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Rejoice! Good to see you've I'm taken it well. <laughs> Good to see you're pretty compassionate there in my time of sadness. Ladies and gentlemen, I will make it up to you. Once the chips have been distributed and he no longer has this power over me, I swear to you, I will double bass it at some point in the future. I am soaking it up. Thank you, everybody.